Hey guys, so I finally got home from Walmart. It's like a couple hours later. Um, I didn't make an intro, so I'm gonna make the intro now. So, hi guys, it's Vika Love. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. If not, thank you for staying with me because it's been so long. <laughs> it's been such a long time since I posted anything for you guys. And there's a good explanation for that. Part of it is school and then starting work. And then the biggest part is really my laptop like the memory is full and like i've been trying to delete stuff um but that thing is still full and that's really bad because it's a one terabyte it has one terabyte uh, one terabyte of memory but <sighs> this this is gonna get posted this is gonna get posted okay regardless it's gonna get posted i'm gonna find a way it's gonna get posted i have a whole lot of videos to get out for you guys but I think this is going to be my first of many. So this is like present day. And the others that I'm going to put out are like from the past. But they're good quality videos. Like they're good content. Like it's a lot of nursing school stuff, graduation. Um, the past three jobs that I started in the hospital that I feel like is good content for people that are also interested in doing that. And then nursing school, not nursing school, like working as a nurse. Um, a couple of military videos and I think there's like some other stuff too but that's what I'm remembering but yeah so anywho the purpose of this video is to go through my little um, Walmart haul of um, like personal hygiene stuff um, I might show you guys my groceries I did like a quick little grocery shop at Walmart while I was there because my fridge was looking a little sad like it was looking very sad and i needed at least a couple of things so i did that but yeah so hygiene groceries and then like some smell goods and cleaning products for the house all right so here's the groceries the little mini grocery haul got me some eggs i think egg prices went down unless it's just me so i could have sworn like a couple months ago this 18 carton of eggs was like five dollars but today it was like to something so i was like okay egg prices went down um i got some grapes some green ones and some red ones to have like a little variety some lettuce and i have some um deli meat right here to make some sandwiches with the bread of course um i got some cranberry juice they stocked up on that and some more milk to stay stocked up on that um i got one sad little red pepper right here <laughs> i'm having like a lot of other peppers in the fridge so i'm like I don't have red let me just get that one red um so pineapples to never have too many pineapples ladies um some chicken breast is like a six or seven six case but some chicken breasts and paper plates because i don't want to be washing like plates all day so my my 200 count of paper plates and some paper towels and broccoli oh and I also bought ice cream, um, the little ice cream sandwiches. Um, and that's in the freezer right now. So, yeah. And that's pretty much it for groceries. All right, guys, we're going to be moving into the hygiene stuff. Um, I didn't get too, too much because um, I didn't need too much. I have, like, I guess a lot of the stuff that i need there was like stuff i saw there that i wanted to get but i was like you know what vika don't do it you don't need it and we kind of on a budget so i tried to like dwindle it down to just a few things like i know you guys saw the tree hut um body scrub the coco colada it smells amazing but i'm like i don't need it i have like three others already in my bathroom so i was like all right put it back so that's what i did so you're not gonna see that um now but you guys did see that in like the first little clip of when i was shopping but yeah so first thing i got is the flamingo razor so i've been hearing about this on youtube like so much 
and I'm like you know what it's time for me to try it so the flamingo like I hear that it gets like a close shave like it was between this or a man's razor um but I'm like I don't know I feel like they're almost the same because like the men's razor has more blades and this has five blades just like the men's razor so I'm like you know what I'm gonna try this I'm gonna give it a try and the brand I was looking at for the men's razor was like Harry's I think it was called and then I was doing like some googling and it basically said that Harry's kind of invented this I don't know if, how correct that is but if that's the case I'm like they're basically the same thing so I'm gonna give it a try um hopefully it lives up to everything I've been hearing I mean it claimed this an award winner so we will see we will see um after that I got the um Tahitian vanilla bean shave oil from tree hut um from tree hut I've been hearing a lot about these too and I want like my legs to be extra smooth when I'm shaving so I'm like let me give it a try because usually I'll either use like shaving cream like if I'm at my gym because they usually provide like a variety of different shaving creams for us or honestly <laughs> majority of the times if I'm shaving here I'm using soap like I'm putting soap lathering it up on my legs or wherever my under pits and we are shaving and I mean it worked fine but I was like I really did want to try this I'm like you know what let me try this let me give this a try let's see the difference in how it feels so I'll update you guys and let you know how it feels on my skin um so do we have any other no uh, I think we'll move into like lotions so I got this I also haven't tried this yet either but I've used the Cetaphil um brand before I use like the face wash um usually a lot of times I use the face wash either when I'm traveling because I have like the little travel size or like when I actually do like a full face of makeup because I use that as like my primary wash like my pri primary cleanser and then I have um, a clean and clear um, either morning wash or night wash but majority of times I've taken off my makeup is at night so I would go in with the Cetaphil um, facial wash and then go in with my nighttime clean and clear wash and it works pretty good but I bought this this is actually a cream a moisturizing cream I was actually looking for cocoa butter because I was trying to find a cream for my face and the Walmart that I went to they didn't have cocoa butter like at all and I was like what <laughs> but yeah I usually always use cocoa butter on my face but I'm gonna give this a try like you just use a little bit because I don't want my skin to be breaking out because I usually like I have clear skin for the most part um, and all I use is my little clean and clear morning wash in the morning and then I put my cocoa butter on my face and I mean that's pretty much it just cleanser and cocoa butter <laughs> and then of course like a sunscreen or whatever it is um, but yeah so I'm gonna try this hopefully it's good I like the brand itself so I have a good feeling about this but I'll let you guys know about this too. Next, we have this for body lotion. I've been running low. I use this a lot. Um, so my skin type is like dry. So I need like something that's like very rich and hydrating. And Vaseline, like it's been good for, to me so far. Uh, I feel like it hydrates my skin. A lot of the times I'm going in like with multiple moisturizers. So like after my shower i would like i said i use the cocoa butter on my face and then i put it on like several other little spots on my body as well and then i would go in with this next um and then after that i would go in with um the palmer's um is it a coconut oil or cocoa i think it's a cocoa oil yeah i would go in with like a body oil basically to top it off and it just it leaves my skin feeling extra smooth especially if it's like one of those nights where i'm using the tree hut body scrub and then i go in and do all that oh my gosh y'all my skin will feel like a baby's bottom like i kid you not it feels like a baby's bottom but yeah Wal walgreens um vaseline has not failed me so i bought another little eh, it's like a medium size um a medium size body lotion um I was thinking about like trying to some trying something new but like I said we was on a budget so I was going with what I already knew um, yeah 
Next up, we got some vitamins. Um, my vitamin is running really low. I literally have like maybe two days worth of vitamins left. So I got the Vitafusion um, Women's Multi Vites. Um, I've taken these before and they were pretty much fine. Um, what do I have right now? I think I have one a day. Yeah, I think I have one a day in my bathroom. Um, like I said, but that's almost done. So I went back to the Vitafusion. Yeah, so I just went back to the Vitafusion just cause, I don't know. <laughs> it was the cheapest thing I saw, like I said we on a budget okay like i'm probably down the line there's like a no budget hygiene um come shop with me or whatever it is but today i guess we're it's like a little budget a budget walmart haul for hygiene and kind of everything else all right so we got a couple like maybe three more things on the hygiene side of the haul so i got this little vaseline because usually i don't know like right now i'm pretty much just wearing vaseline and then like a light clear lip gloss i usually like use the vaseline as my base usually um but yeah it just depends but i got a little one of these and i usually carry these around with me um wherever i go um and then i got some makeup remover wipes um because i'm running very low um on them usually i get like neutrogena or i've used the quate a lot um and like I don't know, I feel like both Equate and Neutrogena kind of like irritates my skin a little bit, but the Equate irritates it just a little bit more. But it's like over here is like where the irritation is. So I've seen these Avino Common Restore makeup wipes. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna try this. And I looked at the reviews and it says like it's very calming, like it doesn't irritate their skin. And it also has oat in it. So like if you guys don't know, oat is like a calming effect so like if someone if one of y'all has eczema for example like they'll tell you to put some oat on your skin because it will like literally calm down like the itching and all that extra stuff so i'm looking forward to using these um yeah i'm looking forward to using these i'm gonna be doing and i'm gonna do like a full face of makeup next week because i have modeling um so i'll use it then and see but I think I think this is this gonna be a winner. I think it's gonna be a winner. I hope so. It was kind of expensive. Like I think this little thing was like eleven dollars. I'm like Lord, but I think it's gonna be worth it. Okay, so last on the body hygiene is some body wash. Um, I just got one because I do have some already here. Like I have like one full one and then two that are like halfway or a little under halfway. Um, but yeah, I just got this, the Soft Soap um, Gentle Wash. It has oat milk and comforting honey, um, comforting honey, comforting vanilla. Um, Y'all, this smells so good. I love the scent of this one. Oh my God, just like, I don't know how to describe it, but it smells so good. If you guys see, see this in the stores, like I need y'all to smell this and get it. But this is also like a really good body wash. Um, I like how it feels on my skin. It lathers up well. It is hypoallergenic for my little my little <laughs> it is hypoallergenic for my girls who have um sensitive skin um but yeah like if your skin is like irritating you this is a really good body wash to use like it's great i've been using this for a while like i love it like it's really good <laughs> all right so next we're gonna be moving into like the home smell good section of the haul i don't know what else to call it it's like it's pretty much all stuff that makes your home smell good or like little cleaning products so we gonna call it the home smell good section um so i bought some hand wash because the hand wash um that i have now is like running a little bit low so i'm like you know what let's not let it run out so i got these two right here um it's the suave brand um i've never used these before but when i smelt it in the store y'all amazing like this is like it has such a warm smell the um milk and honey amazing and then this one the cocoa butter and shea yeah oh <laughs> yo it smells so good um it has like a very sweet scent to it and it smells so good like like it tickles your heart or like it might just be me 
but it literally tickles your heart y'all like if y'all in the store and y'all need some hand wash get you some swab because they're not gonna disappoint okay so this isn't really like home related but it's car related um i got some like plugins for is it it's considered plug-in i guess a plug-in for your car so i got the febreze brand and i also got the um gain scent brand so i got this right here and this one just has like three different scents it has a linen and sky scent um the original Oh, they're both Febreze. I feel so dumb. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, so it has the Linen Sky scent, the original Gain scent, and then a Hawaiian Aloha scent. So right now in the car, um, I have the Hawaiian Aloha scent. Ooh, it smells so good. Like, I think I have, like, an obsession with, like, just, like, smell goods around the house. And it's just, huh especially candles i did buy some but we're gonna get into that um soon we're gonna get into the candles soon like i bought a lot of candles like i just have such an obsession and then i also got um this scent right here the cozy campfire oh guys the cozy campfire so i had the spray the febreze spray like that you spray around your house with it and i love the scent so then when i saw one that it had one for the car i was like I'm definitely I definitely need to get this so that's just what I did so I'm excited to use this. I'm probably gonna use this more towards like winter Christmassy time because it just the cozy campfire it just gives that warm cozy Christmas vibe by the fire like that's literally what this scent gives like it smells so good so next we're gonna move into sprays so like I said my cozy campfire y'all my cozy campfire this stuff smells amazing I had to get the two pack because I do not want to run out. It smells amazing. Like, I wish they had a candle for this one. You know, they might. I'm going to look into it. I also got the Febreze Fig and Plum scent. It's a limited edition one. Um, it smells pretty good. So I'm like, hmm, let me get it. Because I was like, no, you could wait and get it later. But I feel like some of the limited edition ones, they be disappearing. So I'm like, let me just get it in case it disappears because it, it smells really good it smells like how i explain this like i mean it smells like what it says but it's a warm it's like a warm slightly sweet scent yeah i think that's how I, that's a good way to explain like a warm slightly sweet scent. want to some more smell good so i got some airwick um essential oil i got the um fresh water smell and the what is this fresh pine and juniper i think that's how you say it. fresh pine and ju juniper scent um to plug in around the house my room so i bought this um, I don't know if you guys know what this is, but it's like you, so like as you guys can see in the picture, like it's like a little sticky thing that you stick into like the inner, the inner, um, <laughs> like the inside of the toilet bowl, right? But it's like, I guess towards the corners or whatever, right? You just stick it there and like when you flush it, it gives off like a nice scent. So it's not just like the water like flushing away the thing like yeah it's flushing away but it's also giving off a nice scent so like this one is like the lavender scent that's gonna give off and i've used these before and i do like it um it does leave like it's well it's smelling good so i wanted to restock on that so i have like windex for like my glass and mirrors and stuff but i, f I don't know if it's just me i feel like the windex is not doing a trick so i was on um youtube it was probably like a month ago and they were saying that the spray away brand for the glass cleaners is where it's at so that i got me the spray away brand for glass cleaner um and i hope they weren't lying because this is like the two pack set um but yeah i just want it to be extra clean extra shiny extra extra just clear because like the, the windows isn't doing it like it's not doing it at all like i barely see a difference like there's still spots on there like it's, it's not doing the job 
maybe it's like the windex that i have but i don't know and then more for like bathroom stuff um i have these scrubbing bubbles um foaming shower cleaner um the one i have now is like really low so i'm like yeah i need to, i definitely need to restock and then we got us some candles okay so i didn't know that um glad made candles i thought it was just like the um the plug-in stuff and whatnot and the sprays but i'm over here at the walmart and i'm like oh they make candles and mind you like if i wasn't on a budget like i would probably literally get almost every scent that they had because they just smelled so good but i just settled and got like two cents um so it's a pack of two for each so we got this one which is the cashmere wood scent Ooh, the cashmere wood scent mm. and it smells like I feel like now it's almost smelling like clean linen a little bit. It, yeah, it, it's weird. So it kind of smells like clean linen right now, but it also kind of smells like a man that smells good. Yeah, it's like a mixture of like clean linen and like a manly, a manly scent. Like, but it smells good. <laughs> it smells good, y'all. And then I got the, um, this is a limited edition one, the fall night long scent. Um, and it says notes of warm campfire and night sky. Um, this one's also like, this is like more of a manly scent, but like it smells good. Like it's just, ooh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> but yeah, it's like, it just smells good. It just smells good. I couldn't help myself. Like, like I said, if I could, I'd probably get like almost every single scent in candles that they had there, except for maybe one of them. But their candles smell amazing, you guys. Amazing, amazing. Um, and then I got like two. Yeah, I got two other candles to show you guys. No, I lied. Three. All right, so I have two um, mainstay ones, um, and these are like two of my favorite ones that they make. So I have the Garden Rain and the Hit the Trail. So I like a lot of like, what I've noticed, I like a lot of fresh scents and like almost folly scents too. Like, I think Hit the Trail might be one of my favorites that they make. Yeah, oh, oh my gosh. It just smells so good. It's like a foresty. It's a foresty scent, but it gives off winter. Like smelling it, it just for me it reminds me of the winter. Like it reminds me of Christmas time and the fall time at the same time. It's like ah, oh, it just makes me happy. And then the um, garden rain. The garden rain is just like a nice, fresh, almost flowery flowery <laughs> flowery scent yeah so i really like these two from mainstay um i actually have a garden rain one that's burning right now so the last candle i have is um a great value candle and it's the mandarin and teakwood scented candle and guys so when i tell you this smells identical to the um bath and body what's it called oh mahogany teak <gasps> mahogany teak wood it smells just like that and if y'all know mahogany teak wood oh my gosh y'all know like mahogany teak wood smells so freaking good like yeah mahogany teak wood is probably one of my favorites from bath and body works and this literally smells just like it like it's the dupe for it like literally mm, for yeah it's definitely the dupe for way less of the price because that that mahogany teak will, will run you a good 25 26 dollars and this one was like i think four or something maybe five but you saving a good a good almost 20 dollars if you get the great body brand from walmart it smells amazing all right so that's like pretty much it and then i also got like some um sheets for my bed um so i got the 
Better Home and Garden. Um, and I got the, what is this one's the cotton one? Yeah, I got a cotton set because I don't think I have any cotton sheets. Like all the sheets that I have are like the microfiber ones. So I wanted to try the cotton sheet and see how it feels on my body. Um, yeah, I just, wanted, I just wanted to try it. <laughs> so I just wanted to try it. So I got this one in this color. Um, I feel like almost all the good colors, or at least today at this Walmart that I went to, like the good colors that I really wanted they only had it in like the full size and my bed is not fitting a full like my bed is a queen <laughs> um but yes yeah, so i got this color and then i got two mainstay microfibers because i like the color like this one i really like the color of it it's really pretty and then i got the jersey sheet set um the material just feels great like it's like a i don't know it almost feels like a sweatsuit like I probably won't put this on my bed now um definitely for the winter time um just because of how the material feels um but I'm excited to use them but yeah that is it for my little Walmart hygiene grocery and home smell good haul I hope you guys enjoyed it um like I said there will be more videos to come um probably I don't know I don't know if I would do like a mixture of present day and then the past but like I said right now I have a lot of videos from the past with that has like a lot of nursing school stuff with like clinicals graduation taking the NCLEX um and then I have like getting a job as a pediatric CNA getting a job as an infant care getting a job as a nurse um day in the life of a nurse um and then I have like I think I have a couple military videos and maybe like one or two travel videos so like I said I have a lot of stuff to get out to you guys um but this video is gonna be first so yeah so like I said I hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe and bye guys it's bigger, bigger love.